Hello friends, I'm Sandy Scroggins. I am here today to show you how I made my design team card for Let's Craft and Create. The double-sided cardstock I used was Bow Bunny's Black Tie Affair, and I used both the front and back side of the cardstock. The digi stamp I used was by Sweet and Sassy Stamps LLC and is called Wedding Day Wishes. For adhesive, I used Art Glitter Glue and my ATG gun. The card is standard American A2 size, which is 5.5 by 4.25 inches. For measurements, please visit my coordinating blog at thecraftybean.com. Now let's get started. I cut a piece of black tie affair cardstock to 5.5 by 4.25 inches and adhered it to the card base. I cut two more pieces from the black tie affair cardstock, one at 5 by 5.5 inches and the other at 5 by 6.5 inches. I adhered the smaller piece to the top of the card at an angle, turned the card over, and trimmed away the overhang. I adhered the larger piece to the bottom side of the card, turned the card over, and trimmed away the overhang. This created a curtain effect on the card. I adhered two pieces of clear glitter pinstripe peel-offs by Love From Lizzie on the top and bottom layers to separate the two different patterns and to add a little bit of sparkle and shine. The black color underneath the peel-offs caused them to have a green tint, which added a little bit of color to the card. I cut the digi stamp sentiment to two and a quarter by one inches, cut a fishtail on the right side of the sentiment, and adhered it to the bottom left side of the card. Then I adhered two green gemstones by Picket Fence Studios, one to the top left of the sentiment and one to the bottom right of the sentiment. And here is a look at my design team card I made. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe and please give me a thumbs up. Let me know what you think. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.